Architects and designers get up in the morning wanting to make the world a better place. There are so many areas of need ranging from issues of homelessness on the one hand to the global climate catastrophe that we're facing on the other. What is our role in that? Architecture is changing dramatically and NGIT is very much of a research facility and it seems to me that um, architecture needs that kind of look forward. You know, the world's changed and you, you, can't, you can't live from what was. You know, you've got to continue to build on what is going to be. NJIT has evolved into a premier polytechnic university. Our mission is to push the creative edge and to produce informed and engaged citizens. What we build has a profound impact on the way people live, work, play. And so as designers, we really have to think about how do we use technology but never lose sight of that impact. The gift from Bob and Barbara Hillier is truly transformative in the history of this college. It will energize the faculty and the students, it will boost our public visibility and prestige, and it will provide material support to our programs. The Hillier name, Bob and Barbara Hillier name, is associated with a wide range of work, educational facilities, corporate headquarters, public buildings, residential architecture, almost anything you can name, and it's been designed to a high level of quality that has earned them over 300 design awards, and it's also had a reputation for being well managed. In, in yoga, there's this term that we have to root down to rise up. And I really feel like Hillier has a broad history in the School of Architecture. When the first School of Architecture, they took us up in the attic of one of the old buildings there and said, this is the drafting room, uh, make it a school. That was the beginning of it. And they had 25 students. And today the school is like 700 and they were the architects of our renovation and expansion in 1998. They gave an honorary degree to my father, basically the chief scientist for RCA. And then, lo and behold, two years ago, I received one. And I think we're the only one where we have a father and son who've gotten the degrees. We started out as his own firm, really, you know, from the very beginning, small commissions, working his way up to run the third largest architectural firm in the United States. And then he went on to merge with RMJM to, to form the third largest architectural firm in the world. For most of us, that would probably be the culmination of an amazing career, but that really wasn't enough for the Hilliers. And now they've formed Studio Hillier because they really still had that passion to create. That, that is huge to me, the fact that they are in it together. She is in leadership. That is so inspirational to young women that are coming up to see if they can do it, I can do it too. There's a high level of energy in what the university is doing and they're reaching out in, in all different ways. NJIT is uniquely positioned that they have a College of Architecture and Design, they have art, they have engineering, they have urban planning. The idea that this college is embedded with a larger STEM institution within a post-industrial city, it's a laboratory for thinking about the future. I, I think that the, the leadership at the university is very special, and I think that they have been looking for ways in which to enhance the programs that they have, not just in architecture, but in other disciplines as well. They are, you know, a, a hot school. We would love to populate the world with people who have had a design education, which is ethical, practical, visionary at the same time. I think the fact that they are deciding to invest in NGIT shows that the students, they have something to give to the world. What, what we're doing here is it's, it's more important to NGIT than the same gift would be to some other institution. It, it really matters to them. And that means a lot to Barbara and me. This gift is definitely going to give us the resources we need for more scholarships. Uh, more investment in our students. It shows that the Hilliers believe in the vision and the leadership of what's already been framed around the school. What my hope is that the College of Architecture and Design is going to be able to become a leader in finding the path forward for the profession of architecture.